Elf, I'm Ascent up here, and today we're going to be doing the classic playing Doom. Um, so, what's it called? Uh, that's classic, I am not pistol starting. That works. This is the pinnacle of fun, alright. Honestly, the only benefit this one has over the other ones is that I actually left this map with ammo. Honestly, this run took longer than the other one. That's insane. It's like 10 second difference, but 10 seconds is still 10 seconds of my life. I'm not getting back. Um, I'll see if I do this one a bit better. I'm never pistol starting this shit ever. Even if I do a nightmare run, if I'm being honest. That might be the only time I pistol start Doom. So each one on the maps on nightmare is like an achievement in of itself. Yeah, this is rock bottom doom all right. Um, same shit I was saying about this map earlier. Shit ain't fun. I don't know what to talk about. Probably just got... I mean, I was just in... Eh, let's talk about what everyone on the internet's been talking about what's been dead for like two weeks. Uh, that's right, we're gonna talk about Dark Souls. Nah, I'm gonna talk about the Kendrick and Drake beef. That's interesting to talk about. So what's it called? Um, leading up to the beef, I was listening to a lot more Drake than before. So, for me personally, I was kind of like siding with J. Cole and Drake at first. Because what's it called? I've been listening to them a lot more than I had Kendrick, because I went in Kendrick's entire discography. I'm gonna be honest, in more recent months to the beef, I am Good Kid Mad City had been falling off for me. Um, Damn also had like, just kind of like been alright. It's only been until my recent, like, most recent, like, listening to all of Kendrick's albums. I really, like, enjoyed Good Kid Man City and Damn. And uh, I found them to be pretty underwhelming, so. Yeah. Also, because J. Cole had, like, a lot of songs on 2014 to our sales drive, so, like, of course I love that album. So, yeah. And what's called First Person Shooter was just an amazing song, in my opinion. Like even, like, even after all the shit that went down, like, First Person Shooter is still a great song, so it's like, doesn't change any of that. But 
the other way, like, you watch the beef go down, and, like, god damn, Kendrick did not hold back the entire time. No, because he was genuinely fucking pissed at Drake's pedo ass. Yeah, I say, oh, aren't you scared of saying that? Because, yeah, I don't really care. I'm not getting paid from YouTube. I have 43 subscribers. I'm not getting paid anything. I'm not getting paid. I'm not getting demonetized or anything. I'm not really worried. I'm probably going to see one cent a year of anything. Uh... Thank god I had no rockets. Cause y'all saw that, y'all saw that whole shit bang, I was gonna like... Send myself into Narnia. Holy shit. Oh, is this one I might actually just like... I'll come back fully healed up. Man, there's not a lot of ammo on this map. Sweet. I'm like fucking 12 with that comment. I don't think I've heard anyone say the word psych in like 10 years. Yeah, it took longer both of my runs, if I'm being honest. I think I was already done, or it was like 5.40. I don't think I'm gonna really accomplish a fast run of this chapter, if anything. Because like, it's like... What the hell am I gonna do at this point? That's the last enemy, awesome. Of absolutely no loot. I'll just grab the mega armor and bail. This ain't great map. Kind of like rock bottom. Also, this map's a lot more interesting on ultra, on like fast monsters. I was gonna call it Ultraviolence Plus, but like solo net on the Unity part. But yeah. It's a lot more interesting because it's just complete garbage. See, this run's gonna play out differently. Because this time around, I have Omniscience. Omniscience and a crappy keyboard. I don't know, we're like 15 seconds in and the keyboard problems begin. This must be a record or something. It usually takes longer for my for my keyboard to decide it wants my ass on. I guess not today. Today, it's right off the bat. Are we seriously?
I don't know if I've made it past this map. All I remember is this map's bad. I'm not gonna lie, most of these maps are straight ass. That's the hard part of Doom 1. Doom 1 isn't hard and difficult, it's just hard to get through. Like I said the other time, I didn't know this room was rotating. I guess the the room taking shape, I guess. Why use, why use like the moving textures like that? It's so strange. I missed like 90 shotgun blasts because I'm like too tired. I'm actually tired, but it's wild because I've done like recordings at midnight and I'm not tired, but it's 6 in the afternoon. It is 6 in the afternoon and I am exhausted. Just go kill those things instead. If anything, I'll just. I'll just use a plasma gun as the ultimate negotiator of problems. America. I'm depressed. This shit's a new low. just far on stream to prove a point. I am exhausted from this. It's really like the first, like, just Doom 1 that brings out the most exhaustion in me. This is not a good game. You may ask, why the hell do you play it then? Have you seen the modding scene on this shit? It's fire. Oh. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know what the, where the six monsters are. They might be in that whole ass area, I don't know. Something tells me. He'll open that. That's my answer. I have to watch these buffoons mosh each other. Like, 5k resolution. Ooh. Oh no, that's one secret. I was gonna say, there's still three secrets left. I'm not even reading right. I was reading items, and what do you mean three left? There's four. Um, my brain is mosh pitted and completely evaporated. 
I'd like to apologize for being dumb, but like... Actually, no. I, uh, I'm gonna apologize for being dumb. I did this to myself. I blame YouTube for this, but like... My guy, I'm the one who decided to play Doom 1. And I knew this shit was the pits. Like, this shit's rock bottom. And Doom 2 isn't much better. Oh, god. I don't actually think- What the fuck do you mean that monster no It's probably a lost soul, if anything. We got a backpack for Lamona. Oh, no. Shoot two rockets here. Oh yeah, we're shotgunning. Look, my god, this shit is rock bottom. This is like actually like. I can probably say playing Doom was one of the low points in my life. Which means I have a pretty good life. I might come back from that for that loot. Might. I'm really exhausted for no reason. It's not like this is super difficult. It really is that playing Doom 1 is just exhausting. It's not fun. Not that it's bad, it's just not great. Got a little bit of everything in that room.
This map is actually the pits. Oh wait, you have to walk back here. Yeah, I prepared a BFG shot and I still got hit. That's awesome. So what I was talking about earlier, yeah, the Kendrick and Drake beef. In their way, it's not, it's, it was very entertaining to watch. I, I was, I was forced to watch, um, the main artist I was defending, J. Cole, get slaughtered in live. Just catching strays from everyone. It was a very entertaining two weeks. I saw how deranged all the fan bases are. I just realized the Drake fan base is full of lunatics. Oh god, I don't want to play no end in sight. Playing no end in sight is like slamming party drugs the night before returning back to school. And I couldn't just not use a shotgun, you know? I save on ammo every other time I've saved on ammo. And it just ends up being me fucking getting my ass moshed in the last level, you know? This house of pain and fast sucks ass. Where do I even go next? Oh, fuck. Awesome. I ain't gonna bother. First time I played this map, I did not know what the hell to do. Now I can assume such was the experience for many Americans in 1994. Even though this game came out in 1993. But I don't think anyone in their sane mind will want to play this shit upon release. Why does that floor deal damage? Or was it the one that I don't know and I don't care? Well, I do care. I think I only like the song in E1 in M8 because E1 M8. Anyone M8 is straight gas. Elon in it. E1 M8 is still pretty good, dude. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it's pretty good. I hate this.
I might actually blow my brains out. She was miserable. Um. That's the funniest thing that's happened all map. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's just about the only entertaining thing that's happened the entire time we were here. Okay. Let's go collect our resources. I might face rocket again next map. I'm feeling cute. I did tell she only cute. This shit's miserable. Like, I know y'all see on my face, but this shit's agonizing. I know I don't have to tell most of y'all that, but like, it is. It's painful. Maps are painfully boring on a good day and just damn right bad on a bad day. Oh my fucking god. Not this piece of shit. Anything but this piece of shit. Uh, fuck it. You know what this is for? Finishing on Holy Cathedral in like two minutes. The only reason I'm gonna speedrun this shit is because I absolutely hate this map. I hate this song. Um, I'm j I just about hate everything about this map. I'd love to hear about this from this map's defenders. Because all two of y'all probably have shit taste anyways. I now realize why I hate this map so much. It's the music. It's the No End in Sight memories. I swear to god, No End in Sight might actually be the best WAD I've played, just on basis of how memorable it is. If something can traumatize me that deeply, then that's a really good damn project. That's the nicest thing I can say about No End in Sight. If it could traumatize me that deeply, where it effectively Mandela affects the whole entire like original Doom, because I've mistaken like maps in original Doom for non sight things, like certain things are here, certain things are there. Because no one is very faithful in that aspect. Is it fun to play? Absolutely not. I literally just said it's a traumatic experience, like and so there are nights where I go to sleep and like I remember no one in sight and then now the nightmares return. And you might think I'm exaggerating, but I'm not. No one in sight is like doo doo cheeks. I will find the oh, fuck. I will find that one stupid wall. Oh my god, we're stuck here forever. Oh great, we got to waste our... One of our soul spheres. That was a perfect waste of a hundred bullets. Fuck it. We only need a BFG blast to finish this chapter. Until the last map of above 100 cells, we're good.
This map's about as pleasurable as a kick in the balls. It's the one that's... Amazing. Do they have crushers? Because Doom has absolutely no collision detection and it's a dumb game for dumb people. I hate this. I genuinely hate this. It's boring. Actually, no, not entirely. Actually, no, this ship's still rock bottom, but like, let's see. Good. There's two secrets left, and I'm not allowed to use Doom Wiki, apparently. And I'm not allowed to, it's just that I can't. I'm gonna think myself. This shit's miserable. find a way to just rifle run into this um you do you but like shit ain't fun so, oh. ah, I'm just keeping up about 40 cells so I can always get one BFG blast in but like shit ain't fun um I'm gonna assume the obvious I'm going to do a lot of these cars. Reminds me of Deus Vault. There we go. And that's like rock bottom doom. Okay. Put um, those down there. That's the entrance. I have the blue key. I'm gonna sit back, get comfy on my chair, and my fast demon murder. Yeah, I don't like this map at all. It reminds me of no one didn't sight too much. The way I talk about no one so you'd swear it killed my family in front of me. I 
fucking piss. There's always another layer to hell. I scratched my arm. I'll tell you all the story about how I failed AP Computer Science. I didn't actually fail. I just got like a D minus or something. Problem about the invulnerability sphere is I can't leave this map sooner because I can't tell what the hell's what the hell. Um, there we go. No, my computer isn't broken. I'm just doing this on purpose. I'm gonna give myself an adventure. And I'll shotgun shells. No blue armor here. Probably not. Okay, best map, let's go. The only map that challenges me in this chapter. And by challenges me, I mean that makes me feel like I'm not lobotomized. This is rock bottom. No, do they got any lower than this? I don't know if I've been testing all day or not, but either way, I give up. I don't need the cells. I'm perfectly happy and content in my life.
This is actually like insanely bad. It's not actually bad. This is way more interesting than whatever the hell's been going on for the last hour, but like. Just notice my reaction. I'm completely dead inside. At least when I'm playing my own wad, I have terror sometimes because. Oh god. God, map 7. I thought I might live stream that like later. That actually seems like worth it using my time. So I mean, where the where's the fun in this? Oh boy. At least we have like a few, not much ammo, primarily because I shot 60 shotgun shells into nothing last map. I know it was 60 because I was down to like 40 at the end of it. I don't know if you have lost souls today. Fuck lost souls. And I don't know, I'm not so exactly distracted with these guys. Some banishes you over here. I don't know. I really don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna blow my brain to I swear I've gone there before. I'm gonna be honest, I'm taking the secret exit. It's the secret map is actually pretty enjoyable. That's also because it's a rehash of the easiest map and it's rehash. Damn it. Yeah, so we just gotta do a straight jump or we can do a rocket like Yeah, I'm doing the rock. I'm doing the straight. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it one of these tries. Yeah, remember to land in the sector for the secret completion. Okay, back, back to map one, except it has 70 more kills, so. Go a while on the rockets for this one. I'm a bit more energized for this one. 
We are almost 15 minutes in. I'm not energized, I'm asleep. Uh, this is always garbage. It's gonna scratch my hair. Look, my guy, I don't know what to do. I'm getting antsy. This shit is boring, and I'm from Gen Z, so whenever I get bored, I start losing my mind. Oh no, the shotgun shells are gone. Whatever shall I do? Didn't they nerf the secret here, so it's not a rocket launcher anymore? Yeah, I remember that part distinctly. And they move a bunch of the loot here. I'm gonna be honest. Let's practice our Cyber Demon 2 tap. Oh wait, that worked. That's insane. Yeah, I would. Okay, so y'all are asking what the hell is the point of saying the BFGM on the rocket? I'm about to watch. I have a potion of hold. I realize I'm done with the chapter. like a BFG down there somewhere, but I really don't care. How are they using map? This map will challenge the most challenged of the challenge. done with them. That was absolutely horrible. Besides my reaction on E2M6, um, this was a very mundane playthrough. Um, not much happened. I'm all, I'd almost like to say this, this was basically mute. I don't think my vocals added much because there wasn't much to add on. Everyone said what's been said about Doom 1. It's a game that it's best left to its agents. Because nowadays it's just a fossil. And playing back through it's just painful. I'm being 100% with y'all. Uh, the next map should be an easy romp.
The hardest map part of this map is just not dying to poison damage. Dude, we have more than half the kills. We've been here for less than two minutes. I'm gonna be honest. I don't need rockets in the next map. That 3 BFG blast, that's more than enough. What's my keyboard messing up gonna do? It's just a nuisance at this point, my keyboard messing up. It's not gonna endanger me. Chapter 3 was way easier than Chapter 2. And this one's basically mute. It's just nothing. And honestly, that's how I feel about Doom in the end. It's pretty disappointing. At least Doom Classic. Doom 1. And Doom 2 as well. To be honest, the classics don't hit. They're revolutionary, yes, but being revolutionary doesn't mean much if you're boring as shit to go through nowadays. It's a Herculean labor, I guess. I don't know that one's the final one, but like. I died. I'm not even kidding. I don't know. What? So you can just mess up there if you want. Wait, what? I have not known that for most of my life. As far as I knew my entire life, if you messed up there, you were cooked. That's insane. Yeah, sure, I'll mess up. And we finished. That's about the Lost Souls. You tell me about the Lost Souls. Give me a minute. GG, 20 seconds. That was terrible. Thank you all for your time. I'm not reading this. Doom 1. Doom 1 is a very perplexing game. On one hand, I love it for its historical significance. It's one of my favorite video games just because of how its gameplay is, how its modding scene is. 
but oh my god, the original game is dreadful to play through. I don't actually think I'm ever going to play Doom 1 again. It's way too mediocre for its own good. So fire ascending though. Shit goes hard. Eh, well, what can I say? Doom 2 ain't gonna do much better. It really ain't. Not at its worst. Not at the chasm. That was a revelation and a half. Yeah, single segmented. Uh. That was Zoom 1. Thank you all for your time.